Well, hello everybody, this is Street Outlaws No Prep Talk. Today we're going to talk about Street Outlaws going to Canada in July, in the middle of NPK Season 7. Now, photographs directly to their photo owners, please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming, all about the Street Outlaws No Prep Gangs Race Series and all the other Street Outlaw shows. So, today, it's official. They just announced... The No Prep Kings Canada event that will be taking place at the Rad Torque Raceway and at the Mission Raceway Park in July of this year in Canada. So that is something very exciting. And as you may see, it's going to be July 19th and 20th and July 26th and 27th in Canada. So it's going to be an NPK All-Stars event and apparently... The group that's going to go to Canada is the same one that went to Australia. So it's not going to be the whole field of MPK racers. And I also believe that mostly the racers that were invited are the ones that have two cars. Because since it is in the middle of MPK season 7, one car would have to stay in the U.S. And the other one would have to be shipped to Canada. Even though Canada is not that far away as Australia... But, for example, Justin Swanstrom got invited, and he would actually race in Canada with prenup, and the new car, Bad Blood, would actually stay in the U.S. So I'm sure Robin Roberts would do the same thing, Murder Noah would do the same thing, and some of the other racers would actually do exactly the same. So this is going to be very exciting. I honestly, personally, do not know racers in Canada, so I'm going to do some research to see which racers actually run these caliber of cars in Canada. So I'm sure there are a lot of them. And we did see back in 2017, 2018, I think it was, a street event of the 405 versus Canada. And that was really cool to see. But they were not really running the same caliber of cars back then. So we would have to see who is racing up there that, actually have the same caliber of cars if you know racers that have these kind of cars in canada comment down below and tell me which racers have the potential to beat the u.s because when they went to australia honestly the australian cars with the exception of a few they really didn't run the same as the u.s cars and most of the u.s cars actually went on a small tire in this situation, I don't know if they would actually take the small tire cars or the big tire cars. So we would have to see. But this is very exciting. Two events in Canada in the middle of NPK season. Plus the 15 events we have of No Prep King Season 7. This is going to be one hell of a year for Street Outlaws for sure.